The race for one council seat in Houston starting to heat up. The incumbent in District G, Mary Nan Huffman, says her new challenger, Tony Busby, is a self-made publicity seeker. Jason Miles is live from City Hall with more from both candidates tonight. Jason. Tony Busby tells me publicity is really the last thing he needs. He only wants to help improve the city. Meanwhile, Councilmember Huffman doubts Busby even has the time for her job. From attorney Tony Busby's office at the very top of Texas's tallest building, Houston City Hall is easy to spot, as is all of City Council District G if you look hard enough. Very narrow and yeah. very long. Busby hopes to win a council seat four years after unsuccessfully challenging Mayor Sylvester Turner. You know, I still have the same burning desire to help the city I had when I ran for mayor, and uh, many of the problems that we that we were suffering through then, we're still suffering through now. Busby says his experience as an outspoken attorney may be his biggest selling point. The squeaky wheel gets the grease. The person that's the most informed and is the best at persuasion and advocation. That's going to be the, the council members going to do the best job for your district. Yeah, I don't think he really wants to do this job. Incumbent Mary Nan Huffman took aim at Busby on social media following his announcement Monday just before the filing deadline and doubled down today during an interview with me. I think that the voters have a chance to either go with a self-made public servant or a self-made publicity seeker. Huffman, a former prosecutor and Houston Police Officers Union attorney who tried to unseat DA Kim Ogg in 2020, won a special council election just last year. Since taking office, I've been to 137 homeowners association and community meetings because I want people to know that I'm here, I'm accessible, and if they need something, they can reach out to me. She believes Busby is just too busy to commit his full attention to council constituents, but he says he wouldn't bother running. You know, I don't need any more publicity. Uh, I, I, I don't need this job. I don't need the, the salary. If he was not ready to effectively serve. These two candidates seem to agree on at least one thing, that addressing crime is a top priority. The general election is November 7th. At Houston City Hall, Jason Miles, KHOU 11 News.